And finally, let's take a look at one more test. If the printed circuit board is shorted, you can't find the short circuit with your meter set to resistance. Look, no matter where we test the board, when we measure resistance across the power rails, the board appears shorted. It appears shorted everywhere because all the rails are tied together. The short will often be caused by one of these small capacitors which are wired directly across the power rails. They look like diodes, but they're capacitors. We can't find it with our meter set on resistance, but we can find the short if we move our meter selector to read voltage on the lowest DC range. Connect a battery to the power rails. Connect the ground lead to the ground test point and the red lead, which is connected to the positive terminal, to the 5-volt test point on the printed circuit board. What we're trying to do here is power the shorted board with the battery. Then take the meter and connect the meter leads to each individual power rail one at a time. As we get closer to the short circuit, we should see the voltage drop. Here it's 83. Here the reading is 55. Here it's 21, but here the voltage has gone up, so we've passed the problem. The short must be in this power rail here. Now we can move up and down the power rail to find the shorts. As I move in this direction, the voltage increases, so I'm going the wrong way. When I move the leads down toward the bottom of the board, the voltage decreases as I get closer and closer to the short circuit. If I pass the short circuit, the voltage will go up. And right here, we see the voltage has started to rise. So I'm going to back up and move my leads back the other direction. By moving the leads back and forth like this, I can get down to the exact point where I find the short circuit. The lowest voltage will be the position of the shorted component. In this case, it's this capacitor. Well, that's it as far as our digital multimeter tests are concerned. And you can see that the digital multimeter is an extremely effective piece of test equipment, and you won't want to go anywhere without it. But that's all the time we have for now. So I'll see you next time at the Arcade School. Bye-bye.